You know, whether you fish fresh or salt, inshore or offshore, one of the decisions you're gonna to need to make is am I more comfortable with spin and tackle or conventional tackle? They've each got their place. Let me tell you, spin and tackle can deliver a lightweight lure further than a conventional reel ever can. It's a great way to start for learning how to cast. The downside to it is, is the spool never moves. The bale simply wraps the line around the spool. Now that's a great way to store it, but if you make the mistake of cranking the line while it's going off of the spool with the drag, you'll find that you're ending up with a lot of wraps in your line and a lot of tangles. You wanna avoid that. Be very, very careful with your spin and tackle not to turn the handle unless the line is coming in. Spin and tackle works a lot better if you cast out, you'll notice the rod stays in one hand, which can make it much easier to fish a long day. Conventional reels generally have much more lifting power. Why? Because the spool actually moves and the line comes off of it. You can tighten the drag on a conventional line reel and create a lot more pressure to pull that big fish off the bottom. For bigger fish and heavy lifting, quite often a conventional reel is the way to go. It's difficult to throw it as far as the spinner. You're going to need both when you lay out your tackle arsenal.